So what you see here on the patios and on the drying tables behind, it's like coffees dried in parchment that have different colors. Right here, the colors is a result of how much mucilage you leave on the parchment after pulping and, uh, and washing. So the lighter and brighter ones, they are the ones that are either fully washed or washed and soaked. While the ones that are darker with more kind of brownish color, they have uh, more mucilage on them. Most of our honeys, they're dried on drying beds. And of course, the drying itself have like huge impact on, uh, on the flavor. So the way they dry it on the patio, for instance, uh, will create one flavor profile. If I took that same coffee and dried it on these beds, the coffee will taste different. And if I dry it under shade, again, it will be a different profile. So you will have a different density and different development times on coffees that are, for instance, very slowly dried under shade compared to things that are dried more quickly in the sun. So we can dry coffees from everything to, you know, 10 days up to 30 days.